Hey guys, welcome back. Um, right, so we were in this awful, awful place. Um, what? No, bad leg. Do we have an axe? No. Ah! Ah! Okay. Yep. Yep. I uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> um. Right. This place. Um. I guess I will just make my way up. And uh. See what we can see. Um. Over there. Once we get higher up. Wow, this room is tall. So I should be able to see the far end by the time I get up to the top. Oh, there's trees. And a zombie. And all the stuff that got blown up. And, whoa! Mushroom house. You think I could make it there? <laughs> I don't think I could make it there. <laughs> Maybe if we just, uh... Edge our way along the corner here. Um, I feel like the only way to do this properly would be with a bunch of lava. And just run in and dump it down. Until most of the area is lit up and then just follow in after the lava somehow and try to light it up. Um, so let's see. Oh, oh, there's a skeleton spawner up there. Oh, there's light coming out the window, that's what it is. Okay, first I want to turn back around and put lights here. All right. Um. So another snapshot came out, and that was a pretty cool snapshot. Um. The first snapshot. Um. No. Nope. Get. Get. I don't want you. Okay, we're good. Um. Uh, what was I saying? <laughs> Um, I, I'm totally confused right now. Uh, I've been so bored lately. Like, all day today, I was just, ugh. Ah, where'd my skin go? Why is my skin not... That's weird. Oh, what's in here? Oh, just regular stuff. Hmm. Well, that's how you'd get down. And here's a little... Living area... Oh, okay, it's just the particles from the thing. Oh, dear God. So I'm not going down there. That's for sure. <laughs> this is a horrible place. Oh, no. There we go. <laughs> So, are we, like, totally out of... We have dirt still. Man, I don't like being so low on materials. Let's see. Okay, we're total. Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, my God! Holy... Sweet... Mother of... Okay. Do I have to try to climb up that? Or is there stairs on the inside? Because if I have to try to go through all that water and lava and stuff, that's going to be a pain. Um, okay, so that's interesting. Let's try to make our way down. Again, I'm going to light this up up here just so that nothing gets us. Um, this, little, this little trench around the edge is causing more troubles than I'd like. Um... It would be one thing if we could come out on level with these guys. No, it'd be one thing if we could see these guys. But, uh, that's not gonna happen. So, because, like, I, I run in here and I can't even see anything. I mean, now I know that I can just go, you know, straight ahead and I'll hit that thing. And there's something in the back left corner. But, uh, really, I think the best way for me to get to that is to go around the outside, like, up around the roof, like I just did to get to that little mushroom house. You know, there are probably tools in that mushroom house that I just totally skipped over. Wah! Oh, it went higher. Okay. <laughs> I was like, where did my pathway go? Uh, 
Like I looked in the in the chest in there, but I didn't actually think about taking any of it. I don't know why. All right, and this this house means that we can get mushrooms. Um, oh, we have mushrooms here. Never mind. We're good on mushrooms. But um, let's see. Grab the axe. That. These. These. This. These. And all of those. And the buckets. And the cake. Oh, hold on. <gasps> oh, jeez, why do I have so many... Why do I have saplings? And bone meal. Okay. Um. No, I'm not going to do that. That'd be stupid. Why would I do that? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Uh, here we go. Just because I like having my tools in, in the right order. <laughs> I don't know if that's an OC... Oh, it only go the little trench only goes that far. Okay, well, that's a start. Did I ever check what was, like, higher up here? Was there anything on the ceiling? I didn't really look. And oh, I have an iron axe now. I can just... Um, well, there's that stuff up there. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything actually up. There are a bunch of mob spawners up there. Don't be spawning where I can see you. Oh, that's dirt. Um, I was looking at all those mobs over there. It makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> There's not a whole lot of I can do about it right now, so. Um, I need to get more blocks and stuff before I can actually come back here and do anything. Because, like I said, the best way that we can do this is to go around the corner, around the outside edge. Um, so. <coughs> this is awful, like, to, to use this lighting to limit the player's view so much. Let's try going this way. Or was this the... No, we haven't gone this way yet. I was going to say, was this the one with the drop-off where the gas were, but... No. Alrighty. Glowstone. Oh, God. Ah, uh, simpler times when, um... Oh, jeez. Glad I saw that. This lava may become useful pretty quickly. Oh, jeez. What the? Let's just dump that down. Um, that should be enough to kill them. I am playing on 1.1, 1 .1, uh, like, I mean, 1.0, um, because even if 1.1 comes out, I'll probably be playing this on 1.0, just because I don't really want to... Um, come to the situation where I'm fighting the uber zombies with their awesome AI. And does lava spread more when you're at lower levels? And I just screwed myself, didn't I? Because if I dig down below this lava, it's just gonna pour this way. <laughs> and I can't go down that way. <laughs> oh boy. I see Zisto doing stuff like this with all the lava, and uh, works out a lot better for him. Let's just come over here a little bit. See if we can't get down a little bit. But I guess this does a little bit more used to playing with lava than I am. Oh, and I did turn the music on. Um, I'm going to turn it down to like 20%. I know it gets really loud in comparison to my voice. Um, and ow! Ow! Okay. Okay, that problem is solved. Alright, I have a bunch of stuff on me. Oh, jeez, why is that? Oh, because I'm facing where the sun would be. I was like, why is everything red? Sitting here thinking, you know, somehow I've magically transported into the nether without knowing about it. Where does this go? And why are there so many skeleton spawners? No, stop spawning! Probably just to annoy me. Ow! Creeper, did he fall off? He fell off. Good. I'd love to uh, just make a trap or something, but that's not going to happen. <laughs> I'd, I'd love to get all this sandstone, too. That's just... I'm 
one piece every corner, but... Creeper, I don't like you. There you go. And this, this, these stairs are made of half slabs, so um, that means every other one is going to be an actual full block, which means things can spawn on it, which is why I'm lighting things up so well. That's a wall of melons. Ah! No! That's a stone floor, you stupid creeper! Uh, oh no, no. No! No, I'm dead. <laughs> there was no way I was surviving that one. But I might still be able to go get my stuff. Oh, no, there's going to be lava in front of the doorway, isn't there? Because I had the genius idea of doing that. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Whee! At least there's mobs everywhere. That makes things better. Okay. Let's see, do we have any materials up here that I could just, like, cover that lava with for a little bit? Well, we could use the wool, but I don't see that working too well for us. Is there also a pick in here? There is. And a sword. Let's try this. <laughs> Can't believe I managed to back up into that hole. That was totally stupid of me. I shouldn't have done that. Um, well, obviously I shouldn't have done that, but you know what I mean. Um, so let's see, what was I talking about earlier? Oh yeah, I was saying how I, uh, I've been bored all day today. It's been... There's been so little to do. Ah! Where's my stuff? Here's a bunch of it. Okay. Looks like that's all the stuff that way. Oh, I can't carry it because I've got extra stuff in my inventory now. Oh, and because I need to put my armor on. I hope my armor didn't, like, break from, um, that fall. See, did I miss anything? No, it looks like it's just this stuff over here now. Um. I had... No, I didn't have coal on me. There was... Oops, I just punched my desk. Uh, that coal was in the chest. I did. I am missing a mushroom, but I do believe we have a bunch of mushrooms back at the base, so... I don't want the hoe, but... Oh, I could do this. No, I don't want the hoe. There was a sword over here. There it is. Oh, that's just from the thing. It's a skeleton dying. There's some of my string. There's my brown mushroom. Hmm... What don't I want? Well, honestly, the mushroom, but I'll just leave that there for now. Um, okay, let's see. I am going to light this area up. Because if I don't, things will spawn in here, and it'll be all horrendous all the time. Oh, my cake! Um, hmm... I don't know what I'm willing to get rid of here. What do I have 64 leather on me? Oh, right, I took it from that chest. Oh, I don't want a wooden pickaxe. I've got several stone pickaxes on me right now, so... All right, I was lighting things up. <laughs> I totally got distracted when I found the cake. Okay, where's the next torch? There it is. Oh, this could be dangerous. Oh, and I'm out. But the lava's lighting up the rest. So let's head on back and put this crap in our chest, and then we can uh, head back up and try to get that stupid little thing. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about, guys. Wow, this ledge is a little precarious, actually. Um, I hadn't really considered that. This chest needs to be a lot bigger. I have so many melons with me. I didn't know cake stacked. I guess you learn something every day. Uh, that doesn't need to be there. Yeah, I really need another chest, but I don't have any more wood. Um, okay, guys, I'll, I'm going to stop recording right now, and I will come back when I have a bunch more wood and everything, uh, because I know you guys don't really want to see that. So, yeah, I'll be back in just a second. 
Hey, uh, I was on my way back, uh, also filling in some, some holes in the ground and everything so the land is all nice and flat now, um, just to make it a little easier on myself, and I noticed a little hole in the wall, and, like, there was a block here, but, um, I haven't been down here, so I wanted you guys to be here when I, when I did go down here. I don't know what's at the end of it, looks like some iron, um, pick is about to break. Oh, and a chest. Nifty. Doesn't look trapped. Unless there's some obscure trap that I don't know about. Whoa! Let's just cover over that. Um, alrighty, another one of these chests. I guess it's good to have the leather, at the very least. Um, another cake, what, what happened to my, oh, I left my cake back in the other place, right. I don't really need these buckets. Um, can't really carry anything else. Oh, I can turn this stick into, into some torches so I can carry something, at least. Uh, I can turn this bone into that. I do believe I, I... Did I just get these mushrooms from here? Yeah, I did. Okay, so I can just do that. And carry those. And... I guess I'll grab that. I want to keep the string. Alright. Well, I guess that's it for... Oh, right, the iron. Let's go get that. Oh. Whoa. Almost walked right off the edge there. Okay, looks like there's no lava underneath it. Is it safe? Looks pretty safe. Oh, actually, there's a lot of iron here. I wonder how big this is. Um. Alright. I guess he felt like being generous in a kind of sneaky way. I mean, it was hidden, but it wasn't hidden that well. Enough that I missed it on my way through, but not on my way back. I wonder if that was intentional, so that you'd see it on your way back instead of on your way there. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to do with this. I mean, how much iron do I already have? I don't, I don't know. I don't remember. Um, if it's a lot, then I might just make armor out of this, because, like, I could live on stone tools or even wood tools. I don't need iron tools, but, uh, armor would change things a lot, because iron armor practically makes you invincible, so, um... To have that might make that area that we were just in a lot easier because those things, those areas just have mobs everywhere, and uh, it would be beneficial to have a lot of armor. So I don't know. I'll have to think about what I'm going to do with that. And mob spawner in the ceiling. How did I not see that? That's dangerous. Have I had creepers spawn here before? Like, on me while I was trying to make my way through? Because that should have been spawning, so I'm not sure. But yeah, this is mostly what I've just been doing uh, between when I said I was going to get wood and now, uh, or when I came back in. I was just flattening out the area, making it easier to traverse, um, getting some blocks as well. Because, I mean, I'm going to be mining out the blocks anyway. I might as well just grab some of them and keep them. Because I am going to need a lot of blocks. We went over how I needed more blocks. That was the whole reason for me coming back for wood was because I needed more blocks. So, I'm sure you guys understand. <laughs> I don't know why I keep telling you the same thing, but... Um... Hmm. 
I don't know what to get rid of here. We'll get rid of this half-used shovel. Because, really, I mean, I don't need shovels all that bad. Certainly not bad enough that I can't just use a wooden one. Alright. Hop down here. I haven't put up a video in a while, and I'll probably start uploading these, like, tonight. Um, I haven't been recording these very uh, regularly. <laughs> it's been pretty pretty scarce between episodes, actually. Or, that's not the right word. Pretty... It's been, it's been a long time between episodes. Um, I usually do, like, one episode every couple... Every couple days, maybe like once a week. Um, because before, you know, I had all the stuff to upload. But now I don't have anything else to upload, so I'm probably going to want to keep doing this quickly. And, man, another spawner? How did I miss all these spawners? I'm, I mean, I guess he just hit them really well. Uh, Got to give him props on that. He's He's managed to hide a lot of things that I didn't notice until my second time through. Which is how you'd want to do it, I suppose. And how, where do I get... Jeez, I don't even know. These caves are so long. Like, they're way longer than I was expecting them to be. Um, I was thinking, oh, I'll just walk back to the base. And we probably went, like, uh, the same distance that I've gone so far in this direction. Like, on camera is about the distance that I went before I pulled you guys back in. So it... Oh, I put that there. Oh, here we go. So yeah, I guess I went halfway back on my own. Um, <clears throat> let's see, how much longer do we have on this episode? Um, eight minutes, about. Let's see, how much iron do we have here? Because, just need some of that. Is the iron in this chest? Oh, we do have, yes, the iron is in that chest. We have a decent amount, actually. Um... Let's come over here and get this going. I mined some coal on the way too, because there was all that coal that was that I had just left at the end of that, and I picked it all up and brought it back. And, whoop! My camera just teleported a little bit. Okay, put the leather in here. Man, this needs to be organized. Um, I'm gonna organize this, and I'll be back in just a second, guys. All right, so I uh, I made some chests and I organized my stuff. I've got mob drop slash food slash materials in this. It's just kind of like... I wanted to have food in here, but I didn't really know where to put the melons, so I just put them over here. And um, I had the leather that I wanted to put in this chest, just because I feel like it goes with the the rest of the mob drops that I was putting in here. And since these two were food, and I had I needed space for food, I don't, I don't want to keep that wood in there, actually. Um, I will keep the wood over here. This would be my ores, metals, wood, and sandstone kind of chest until I get, you know, too much of any one thing. Uh, that's what I was looking for. <clears throat> so, we have a bunch of iron, actually. That's that's really good. Um, I made tools, a tools chest. Um, I have plenty of swords and picks, but obviously I'm pretty low on everything else. I have some arrows, but no bows, so they're just going to sit in here for, for now. Um, this is my random stuff chest, which, like, you know, I can put buckets in here, but I'm going to take these buckets with me. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah. And, let's see, how much time do we have left? Probably not a lot. Um, uh, five minutes. I still, I don't know what that is, and it really bothers me, but I don't want to... And I just realized as I was over here, of course, that um, I could have just taken some, uh, taking some of the dirt that I had, and the saplings, and, um, the saplings and bone meal that I had, and used it to, um, blah, sorry, totally just drew a blank, um, use it to grow trees over there. I, I'm still just, I want to know what this, this stupid, see if there's anything to this stupid, um, no, it's just, it's just a stupid looking hole in the wall, for no reason whatsoever, alright, I might as well take this opportunity to get a few blocks out of it, 
since I already dug my way over here. You know what? I'll make this my little, like, my own little sandstone mine for when I need to, um, get sandstone. If I need to get sandstone, I mean, I probably won't for a while because I've got, like, six stacks of it already, but, or maybe five or four. I don't know. I can't count. What do you expect from me? Um, so let's just I'll use gravel. Um, no, I won't use gravel because I'm all OCD and stuff, so, I mean, not literally, but it bothers me anyway. <laughs> okay, let's come along here, take that out, take that out. I just want to wall this off. I mean, I suppose we can have a little window here into that room, but um, I didn't want to have it open to the surface because we're not supposed to go to the surface, so I figure that seems, it just seems a little too much like it's breaking rules. Um... Right, so yeah, we can just have a little... Maybe eventually this will turn into a storage room if I don't feel like keeping all of my stuff over there. Um, by the... Whatever they want to call it. <laughs> Victory Monument? I'm pretty sure that's not it. Man, wooden tools do nothing for, for speed of whatever. Um... But yeah, so I'm probably going to grab some wood before I start next episode. Um, let's see. Is there anything that I wanted to talk about that I didn't yet? Um, I know I started talking about it, but I don't know if I actually finished. Um, the, the latest pre-release, or uh, the latest two pre-releases actually have much improved, um, as far as I'm concerned, mob AI with skeletons and zombies. The first, uh, not pre-release, sorry, snapshots. The first snapshot had, um, improved zombie AI, so that the zombies, um, now actually, like, pathfind to you. Uh, they have pathfinding, so if they are, if you, if they see you, they will actually find a way to get to you if there is one. Uh, meaning they'll climb up mountains and everything, they, and they'll go around walls and everything instead of just walking into them, like they used to. Um, I'm trying to think of a nice way to get up there. I suppose I could use ladders, but that... I don't know. I hesitate to do that. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, we're probably about done here. But, um, so I don't want to play this map on one of the, uh, snapshots. I can never remember that that word. I always want to say pre-release, because they've, they've ruined me for it. But, um... I, because I don't really think that this, I, I mean, it's, it's hard enough, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I, I'm gonna play the map the way it was designed, even if the map maker <laughs> revels in the fact that it's more difficult now. Um, I'm, I'm sticking with the 1.0 for now, um, through this map. I mean, of course, you know, after this map, I will revert to the next update and probably stay there for most of my thing. Like, my Let's Plays and stuff, I usually don't do any pre-releases on, just because... Like, they added jungles and everything, which is really cool, but, um... The... You have to make a new world for it, unfortunately, unless you use, like, NBT Edit, I believe. Uh, BWO said something about it, I don't really know. Um, I'm looking into it, I'm not really sure, uh... If I'm gonna do that or what, because I mean we do kind of have a nice little let's play thing going on um, with our little house on the lake, which I rather like. So I don't know. Um, that's gonna be something I'm gonna have to think about <clears throat> because the jungles are really cool, and I'm kind of disappointed in Jeb for putting in the. Uh, er, well, I say Jeb, but I suppose it's him and John. Uh, is that is that the AI guy's AI guy's name? I'm not really sure. It's, I think it's John, uh, John, Cagstrom, Cogstrom. I don't know how to say it because he's Swedish. I'm assuming. Um, I I kind of just assumed that his name was Jan, because he is Swedish, um, and like it's Jeb's actual name is Jens, so I I hesitate to to call him John, but I I. I think his name might be John. I really don't know. It's it's too similar to an American name 
or at least an Americanized name. Uh, okay, I'll say English name because that's probably more accurate, and uh, I don't know how it would it would come across in a different language. But anyway, that's uh, I I don't like what they did with the ocelots because they turn into like house cats when you tame them, and it's just silly. They should have left it where they just stay ocelots, and that would have been really cool. But now they turn all like you, there's Siamese cats, and then there's a black one with white fur on its stomach, and then there's a a yellow one, which kind of looks like the the ocelot, but it's just it's I don't know. I don't like it. I think it just looks too much like the cats mod that there was. So I don't know where to put this wood. Actually, did I say I was gonna put it over here? I did. Um, but anyway, uh, I have to go. So. Um, I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.